feels great. It feels to get everything uh, situated and I don't know, it's just a huge relief to finally get it over with. So. Let's talk about the process for you. I know you uh, uh, were committed to Utah and uh, how difficult of a decision was it to flip over to Oregon State? Uh, probably the hardest decision in my life so far. Uh, it took a lot of thinking and, you know, a lot of uh, sleepless nights, I guess you can say. Um, you know, in the end it came down, I just think about, I, I thought about a lot of things, prayed about it and everything, and, you know, in the end I felt like Oregon State was the right place for me, so. You know, with a lot of in-schools coming after you, what what made you make the decision to kind of go out of state and maybe try something new? Um, I don't know, I just feel like this is a great opportunity for me to uh, with this coaching staff especially, you know, if this coaching staff was somewhere in state, I'd go wherever they are, but just so I've been there a couple hundred miles away, so, yeah. <laughs> what was the biggest factor of you flipping? I know Kalani Sataki was here, at, was at Utah. Um, did that play a role in you uh, switching over to Oregon State? Uh, yeah, big, like, big time. Um, coach uh, Kalani and Coach Toyaki are two of the main reasons why I'm, I'm headed up where I am or headed go going to where I'm going. Um, you know, those two coaches, uh, I, I want to play for them really bad. You know, I love everything they do. And you can see what they did at Utah with their defense and stuff and everything. And, you know, I just want to go and be a part of that. And a couple of local players like Zach Katoa, Christian Fulau are headed up there as well. <laughs> did you talk to them through the process? And are you excited for the chance to play with them? And uh, yeah, I've been talking to them since for about a couple weeks now or maybe a month you know all of us been talking about the chance that we have to play together and all that so you know it's just pretty cool that uh, it's coming to reality soon so what are your plans uh, immediately are you uh, looking to enroll early uh, I mean what are your plans uh, I'll be enrolling right after graduation so yeah. are you looking to make an impact as far as the basketball team uh, football team uh, I mean just talk a little bit about that. Um, I'm just going to go out there and work my hardest. And if I get the chance to play right away, then so be it. But if I don't, you know, I'm just going to keep working until I finally get on the field or the court. So. Is the plan to play both sports up there? Um, yes, for this first year. Well, mainly for this first year, I'm going up there. And, you know, we'll see what happens after that. So anything you want to say to the Oregon State fans? <laughs> um, uh, I don't. I don't really have much to say. You know, I'm just excited to come and be a part of the be a part of uh, the Oregon State family. So.